What's up guys, it's Zach Hughes of Pathway Performance. Today we're gonna to talk about behind the neck jerk. So the reason why we use this movement is if we're trying to overload the overhead position or if we're having a problem getting the bar back into a good overhead position. A lot of times people have trouble going from the front and getting back into this good position. So this just kind of takes the middle man out and you're already there. So the dip and drive stays the same. His knees go out, his feet stay flat on the ground. He's gonna drive up, split, 50% of the weight in the front, 50% of the weight in the back. You see he's nice and controlled. He recovers front foot, back foot. And that's the behind the neck jerk.